And welcome back to our coverage here on the Texas 24-7 Television Network. And certainly want to thank all of those that make these broadcasts throughout this 2018 season for All Saints possible. And certainly want to thank our friends over there at Hailey Buick GMC Subaru of Fort Worth. Right there off of uh, 820. Go by and see them. Say hi. Say that you saw it right here on the Texas 24-7 Television Network. And after the touchdown, that was a five-play drive that took a minute 50 off the clock and it perhaps might have an onside kick attempt as Andrew Lynn, the freshman, is uh, right there on the line. But no, instead he just pooches this one. Nice little kick inside the 30-yard line. Shallow Sanders finds daylight and might find the end zone. Makes a move and that's it. Church toast gone. Done. Touchdown, Trinity Christian. Yeah, when you, when you line up that way and you don't kick that football away from him, he can hit that on the move. That's that's a tough situation right there. That's that's really tough on your coverage teams. A 72-yard kickoff return for a touchdown by Shiloh Sanders, his first of the season. And the football gods giveth and they taketh. Yes, they do. That's... That right there, you had a little had a little momentum swing for you, but your special teams have let you down, and again they've let you down. We can't get can't get 11 guys on the field, so you're going to get a penalty. This is going to come back. That's what happens when you when you have attrition and when you get guys banged up. You're trying to substitute guys. People don't realize how hard that is to get guys in and out of the game get them lined up and it's hard enough to get your starters to do it and then when one goes down another goes down one comes you know and then the communication on the sideline with the trainers who's hurt who's not hurt you know it's 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 just it's about communication and it's uh when you have a young football team it even makes it more tough in those situations it was uh, joshua powers that were co that was coming off under his own power but slowly after the kickoff return. And that flag still on the turf and the conversation still taking place. And I'm well, gonna tell you this, you know, as, 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 as a football coach, when you start going for two in these situations, you're up you're up 24 here. You know what? You need to be kicking the football. This this feels like a little bit of a, you know what? And I'm sure Coach Beck and his team won't forget this. This is where you grow up a little bit. This is where you say, you know what? This is this is a team that's kind of trying to rub it into us. But you know what? We're going to grow up as young men, and hopefully they'll step up right here and and, and make a play, try to get off the field and keep this two point conversion from happening. Well, these two teams will play each other in the regular season next year as well. It's a little pass to the out, and it's held short of the goal line, so no good on the two-point conversion of attempt. That was completed to Dylan May, but he was taken down in a nice play defensively on that by Will Shipman. A good job by the All Saints group to, you know what, keep them from getting in there, keep that two-point conversion from happening. Well, 44-20 is where it sits now. Saints back on offense with 5-12 left to go in the fourth quarter after this on Texas24.net.